Hello, uh, from my front yard this time. I was up here doing some work on some plants, taking the trash in, and I came across someone who I thought you would all maybe like to meet. Say hello to my cat. Not that kind of cat, this kind of cat. Monarch Caterpillar. It's on my milkweed here, which looks kind of small, but I, it's just because I cut it back for the winter. And th what this caterpillar is eating on are some of these new spring leaves that are just coming in. Just arriving as with, we are with spring. Um, and monarch caterpillars only eat milkweed. Why is that? Why do you think that they only eat milkweed? Uh, milkweed is actually poisonous to a number of animals. Uh, and but somehow along the way, caterpillars, monarch caterpillars, developed the ability to eat that poisonous plant. And by doing so, they make themselves very unappetizing to uh, someone who might want to come along and eat them, like a bird. Um, it's like their armor. They have that milkweed inside of them, they, have, they carry that poison inside of them, and it prevents them from being eaten by another animal. It's pretty cool. Um, now, milkweed is a weed. Uh, and that means when we use an herbicide, like a very well-known one these days, Roundup, made by formerly known as Monsanto, um, it kills the weeds in your yard that you don't like, but it also kills the milkweed that is the only source of food for monarch caterpillars. So if we like monarch butterflies. We need the monarch caterpillars and therefore we need the milkweed. So I'm trying to grow it here and I also try not to use any herbicides at all in my garden. Um, and I also collected some seeds. Let me show you. Collected some seeds last summer. I'm growing a whole bunch. There's only some teeny little sprouts coming in. Not too much. But soon this whole thing will be filled with milkweed. Pretty exciting. Hopefully we'll be around and I'll, we'll track those sprouts as they come up throughout the spring and I'll show you all about it. All right, see you next time.